The other day I was trying to open Eclipse and I got this error message that said workspace unavailable. It's the first time I've ever seen it and uh, I just recently started uh, working on Linux because we moved some of our uh, a production server over onto AWS. So uh, I wasn't sure how to fix this problem. I'm sure if you just reboot the machine uh, it'd fix the problem but if you don't again I'm not too experienced with uh, Linux AWS. Um, in this case, it's saying that there's a lock probably been occurred on the workspace for Eclipse. I, I created this lock by creating two sessions. The first session opened fine, and I, I create another Eclipse se session. And so the first session has a lock on this workspace. And so in order to get rid of that, you can possibly, it, this is assuming that, let's say, you, you are somehow able to close the first session, but that lock still exists. Um, you can go through the directory. So I'm going to go to my Eclipse workspace based on that screenshot over here. You need to go to your workspace. And so I'm at the workspace here. Uh, you need to go to a directory called metadata dot metadata, and so you can't see that. And if your Groovy uh, Explorer allows you to, you can do uh, show hidden files, go into metadata, and then you'll see that lock file. And if you delete it, it should allow you to finally open uh, the workspace. I'm assuming I probably can't delete this, but I'll show you what happens. Um, I'm trying to get to the first session. I'm going to close this. Hopefully, you'll see that the lock is gone. But it's, I guess it's, it's it's working fine now. Of course. But anyways, if you can get to this file, which is in your workspace for Eclipse, and then go to dot metadata, it may be as easy as just deleting this lock file, and then you can finally open it. So if easy thing is if you can just delete this. And that will remove your problem. You can also do it from, of course, terminal session. And there'll be a hidden file. Let's see if I can actually delete it when it's in use. You can see the lock files over here. Let's see. I'm going to go from terminal session this time. Uh, CD Eclipse. Oh, uh, so I'm in the workspace. Because it's a hidden file, I'm using dash LA option on LS. I'm going to go to CD. Dot, and then I'll see. Again, it's a hidden file. Dot log. And if you're lucky, you can just remove it like that. And you can see the lock file has been removed. And then you hopefully can log in. Again, this is the problem where if you have a session that didn't close well for Eclipse and it has a lock on the workspace, then it'll give you this message over here. Sorry, I can't reproduce it exactly the same way that it happened for me during work, but I'm just showing you that where the file is. Because when I was reading it online, they said just go to the metadata file. They didn't mention it's hidden on your workspace. And so you can see I'll try to launch this and I'll get this error. And so it's due to this lock file that needs to be deleted. It, if you can't delete it, you may have to kill the process that's holding on to the file.
And so that's a different story. So hopefully this helps someone. I don't know. I'm just, this is more for myself because I'm assuming with my kind of bad luck, it'll happen to me again where the workspace is still, where I was just, I just left the session open in Linux and then it just closed, like Eclipse closed on me. And then when I tried opening it back, I got this message over here, workspace unavailable. So this is just one thing. They mentioned three ways to fix the problem. And I'm assuming the second way is making sure you kill the Eclipse process. Uh, and that's a different story altogether. So we'll call it a day. Over and out.